Hey, it's Kay. Welcome or welcome back to another YouTube video. I got a good video for y'all today. Today's video is going to be a glowy, smell good shower routine. So make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to hit that notification bell and let's get into the video. Okay, so the first thing I use before I get into the shower is I use my Equal Tools dry brush. So I already listed out the full benefits of dry brushing in one of my past videos, but I can give y'all a little bit. The main thing I use dry brushing for is exfoliation. So it helps with unclogging pores, blood circulation, all that. So if you have strawberry skin, this product is for you. And it really does help kick up dead skin before you get in the shower. So the next thing I go in with is my beloved vegan soap bar. I had to listen to the TikTok girlies on this one because when I tell you I felt so clean by using a bar soap first and then a the liquid soap after, y'all, they was onto something when they said that. I'm just going to let you know. Washing with bar soap first really is just to get that first clean done because when I tell you it makes you feel squeaky clean. So really think of it as like a double cleanse for your body. So bar soap first and then the liquid soap. Now I go in with my beloved coconut and warm vanilla shower gel. So this does have essential oils in it, so it does bring back that hydration that the bar soap took from it. And y'all already know I'm going in with my hydro towel from Target just for some extra exfoliation. Now it might just be me, but I can really see from this clip that the hydration is there. So the next thing I go in with is the Tree Hut Vanilla Sugar Scrub. Yeah, and I know y'all gonna get me for this one because I'm always like, oh, Dr. Teal's is better, this, this, this. Yeah, but when Dr. Teal's comes out with a vanilla, just know I'm hopping on that trend. Cause something about salt scrubs just do it for me. But this is a sugar scrub and it does really help, but it just really don't get that coarse feeling like a salt scrub does. But there's one thing I can't deny, and that is the scent because it smells so good. And the shea in it already has my skin glowing. Look at the right leg compared to the left. The difference. Okay, so next I go in with the Tahitian Vanilla Bean Shaving Oil. If y'all can't already tell, I'm trying to go for a vanilla scent. But this shave oil really helps the razor glide. And don't forget, since it's an oil, it brings back that extra hydration while shaving. I actually haven't picked up shaving cream or shaving gel in so long. All right, let me go ahead and give y'all my holy grail. This Aveeno oil mist, it is nothing to play with. If you have dry skin, mark my words, this is for you because no matter how much hydration I get in the shower, it really, my skin is so dry. My skin is a desert. It sucks up hydration. And this product helps it so much. Next, I go in with the Tree Hut Vanilla Body Butter. Y'all probably thinking, Kayla, did you just put on some oil? Yeah, I'm trying to get that glass skin effect on my legs, on my arms. And body oil only helps keep that hydration from the shower. I'm trying to have that hydration throughout the day. Not to mention the smell. Oh my gosh, the scent from that, I can literally eat it. It smells like ice cream. And just from this alone, I already get compliments on the way I walk past people and they be like, girl, you smell good. Yeah, I know, it's all my products. Now, obviously this is optional, but I like to top off my vanilla scent with my Mod Vanilla by Ariana Grande. Now, I'm telling y'all, I got this for Christmas. It's March. I haven't been able to put it down. I use it every single day. I could really walk around ashy, no products, nothing, and get compliments off of that perfume. But look at that glow. And the body butter has glitter in it. Oh yeah, I'm be shining in the sun. That's it for today's video, and I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you in the next video. Bye. <laughs>